Yeah. It's that same shit I'm talking about, bro. Watch, she about to bunny hop straight out into the open line of sight. Not even checking to see if people are around this corner, like, peeking or nothing, bro. And what makes this more scarier is she's gonna jump out and she's gonna say, Oh my god, it's four of them. But if you look at the UAV, all these niggas on the map. That's crazy. Bumba Clot, yo, uh, Guan. Now, where do I start here? Because a lot of people have been waiting on my opinion on Nadia's land event. And come on, just watch this clip and we all know what happened. This clip right here proves why I am the best female Warzone player. Boy, ain't no way, boy. Boy, ain't no way, boy. Now, besides all the body gameplay that she provided us to actually, you know, make this video and prove that, hey, bro, there's no way this person is playing Warzone and is holding 40 plus kills a game. And I'm gonna break down everything about her going to LA and proving that she doesn't know a goddamn thing. But I mean, other than that, it's just Black Ops 1, Black Ops 2, like those other games. I have, I heard that there's dolphin diving and I don't know what that is. And I don't know what that is. She really want me to sit there and believe that she played Black Ops 2 and don't know what a dolphin dive is. Boy, ain't no way, boy. She really wants me to believe that she played Black Ops 2, but every time she saw a shock charge on the ground, she couldn't understand what it was. And not even that, if you run into something that electrocutes you the first time, wouldn't you learn by the second time? Oh, okay. Boy, ain't no way, boy. Bro, but not just that. Now I'm gonna show you what a lying piece of shit she is. I only played MW2. From what I saw, I like it. Um, I only played MW2. I'm gonna be honest with you, chat. Yesterday, they gave us a rehearsal time, okay? Come here and play. I, I did not play at all. I am probably the only person in this room that has not played the game once. So if you guys see me play like dog shit, it's because one, I haven't played at all. I, I have not touched this game. And two, I was not allowed to bring my Cronus. I only played MW2. Boy, ain't no way, boy. <laughs> She not only sat there and lied through her goddamn teeth, but she tries to use that as an excuse to why she's gonna play bad. Now I can sit here and show you all the clips that you guys have already seen, but I'm not gonna do that. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna break these clips down for you and explain to you why she is so dog shit and why this land event actually just proved that everything that we were saying from months ago is true. Not only that Nadia core fundamentals of playing an FPS shooter is not even here, she always jumps into open lines of sight without jiggle peeking a corner, without checking. She just jumps straight into lines of sight, which is the weirdest thing. And even after I unpause this, she goes ahead and does it again. Oh, damn. Why is it that the best female Warzone player has some of the most dog shit centering that I've ever seen in my life. I've never seen a 3KD player with centering this bad. She sent it on the stair and not at the top of the stairs where a potential enemy could pop out and challenge her. Boy, ain't no way, boy. Oh, and if you think I'm being biased, Let's go to a person that defended her and said that she wasn't cheating and also in that same video say that she has some of the worst centering that he's seen in his life. She's not hacking y'all. Look at look at where she's aiming currently. She's aimed down at the floor. She just has bad FPS mechanics. Crosshair placement is a big deal. Now this goofy guy right here is saying that she has bad centering but centering literally will make you a three or a one KD player. If you have bad centering, you're not a three KD player. You're not gonna be a three KD player if you have bad centering. That's a core fundamental of an FPS shooter. I don't care what FPS it is. Third person, first person, Apex, any FPS game. If you have bad centering, you're not winning gunfights. Cause me and myself, I have a 3.5 KD. Um, and when I watch Nadia's gameplay, she is doing a lot of things that don't line up with what good players do uh, as far as the centering aspect you know all these good players aiming chest high aiming uh towards the head you know and then every single person is calling her out for aiming at the lower torso but her aim is really good it is really good aim so if you're missing aspects of your game uh and don't play the game 
towards like the core fundamentals while you're not following those fundamentals it's just really hard for me to believe especially as uh you know a war zone coach a person who helps you get better and to see somebody not really do it to the full potential and then have like triple my kd is really really hard to believe that that person is actually uh not cheating now i did that to show you the different kind of content creators the fifth seal not biased he looked at it objectively if this person has bad centering no core fundamentals just jumping into lines of sight but the only thing is that she's just hitting all of her shots man that's kind of suspect because the person with bad centering not following the core fundamentals and have almost triple this kd that's what she's saying is not cheating but then this other guy is saying that she has bad centering but you know what that's normal that's perfectly normal that she has bad centering with a 3kd like bro and it's not just the fifth seal that is kind of suspect on like, is she cheating or not? Just look through the internet. After that LAN event, she kind of proved to everyone that she just dog shit. All right then, Nadia, if you have this much of an ego on Warzone, you think you're the world's best player, let's see how you did at the Modern Warfare 2 event then. I think so. Oh, uh, okay. Your horse shit. Interviewed by a guy named Jake Lucky who was really popular in the community. I really hope you, I, I, I want you to think for a second. If this was a guy and this was a man in the same position doing the same thing and it was accused of the same accusations, right? You guys don't think for a second, right, that this Jake Lucky would be over violent, like overly on your ass. But like this girl is blatantly like cheating and he's trying to help develop her story for her. Do you think this guy is wrong? Cause look what they did to Shifty. When Shifty got him with full squad gaming, he had to prove his shit right there and then. But no, with Nadia, it's just a little interview. Nah, it's just a little interview. If it was me, I would have had a PC set up right there just to pop on her. Yo, play in front of us. Let's see. Let's, let's end it right here and now. Let's end that right here and now. But no. Bro, we all know what it is. I don't understand it. I don't understand the dolphin. Just jumping around. That's kind of crazy. Some of, the, some of this gameplay looks... Same. The like thing? bot this gameplay i'm not gonna lie but i said too i was like how are you not fixing your aim like when you're missing right here how do you not you know go back to the enemy if you're missing it's fine to start missing a little bit but then you just fix it you go you know what i'm saying you go back to the enemy but damn just leaving it there is like that's proof of like you just you know you're used to the aimbot doing all the work that's crazy i must say this though i am pretty happy that nadia came here and blatantly started cheating and actually was very very successful it only shows that, hey, with the right people backing you, bro, you can do anything in life, even if it's blatantly obvious. And I am greatly appreciative of Activision and finding her out there and letting people see the true bot that she is. Activision, you might not have banned her, but bro, I'm not gonna lie, bro. You did one of the best things in the world. Not only did I prove that Nadia would lie to you in your face, blatant that she does not care, she said the day before she played MW2, then the next day she said, oh, I didn't play that. I didn't play the game at all. That's why I'm gonna play bad. Blatantly lies to you in your face. She already got exposed for using an unlock tool. Exposed, not by someone finding out, by someone posting her DM saying that she used an unlock tool. Now she goes to the land event and play like a goddamn bot. And you really think that this person is not cheating? Now what I'm gonna end this note on is what we all know Nadia as, BBB, the belly button bandit, AKA Diglett Fingers, AKA Miss Big Hands, AKA Long Neck Giraffe Head Ass. Hey, low key, we all know she likes shooting the lower torso, but did anybody notice? She was shooting a whole lot of upper chest shots and head shots and hey, goddamn, she even mixed in a couple leg shots. Like, hold up, wait a minute. I was watching live and noticing that she wasn't hitting chest shots, but now I'm trying to find gameplay of her killing people and I can't find any. And she has a Twitch on subscription only, and I'll be damned if I subscribe to her goddamn Twitch channel. But you can barely find any because, bro, there's a lot of clips of her just showing her going negative. Just going negative every game. Uh, excuse me, that's your teammate? She hops out with a full 30 round mag and missed 15 of the shots. This is very, very close and she could not, not adjust her aim to get on this target that was right in front of her. That's crazy. Okay. I'm 
I'm scared to be this girl's friend because she always trying to slide on her own teammates. She trying to clap her own teammates' cheek right here, bro. Oh, God. If Friendly Fire was off, the whole team would have been dead, bro. It's that same shit I'm talking about, bro. Watch. She about to bunny hop straight out into the open line of sight. Not even checking to see if people are around this corner, like, peeking or nothing, bro. And what makes this more scarier is she's going to jump out and she's going to say, Oh, my God. It's four of them. But if you look at the UAV... All these niggas on the map. That's crazy. All right, this is not looking good. Please tell me, please God tell me she hits a shot. Just one bullet. No, 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 no. Turn it off, turn it off, turn it off. I've seen enough, I've seen enough, I've seen enough. We all can tell by now that this girl is an absolute bot. There's no way. I don't care which card you play, it's all the same thing. I don't care if you can't slide cancel in this game of you. It's all run and gun. It's all, hey, you check corners. It's all the same thing. But you know what's so crazy to me? Is so many streamers already said that this girl isn't cheating. Are they gonna take back what they said? I doubt it. But what's gonna happen, she's gonna go home. She's gonna continue playing and being that same 3KD God that she is at home. But hopefully you guys give her some more practice because I know you're not going to call her out. But hopefully you guys give her some practice so when she shows up at the next land, she could actually compete. But you know what? Congratulations, Nadia, on getting your f***ing bag. I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm out.